Yo, what's up you guys? It's Big Joey! And today we're going to be rating different heavy cosmetics. Now, this was a series that I meant to start about a year ago, but I just never got around to doing it. But this was the plan. So I pinged everybody in my Discord and I asked them to put in one chat some interesting hats and some different myths that they'd want me to rate. And then I had my admins and moderators take about 30 of those hats and put them onto one chat for me to officially put into the video. So, now a year later, here we are. But, uh, yeah, all these cosmetics are going to be at least a year old. So, if you guys like this series, uh, this video, we will do another one, obviously much more updated. So, anyways, let's go ahead and start right into the first one. Alright, so first we have the Boris, the Borzo, the Borzo, I, I, don't, I don't know how to say that, but... This is, this is actually pretty awesome. This is like a whole dog. This is like, <laughs> like I like how every TF2 merc pretty much has like a small little pet that they can have like on their shoulder. Like maybe like a little, a little parrot, like a little panda bear. But this is like a full size dog. Like this is like heavy walked into his neighbor's yard like ya -ta -ta, and just broke their fence down and stole their entire ass dog. So yeah, no, I'm actually pretty cool with this one. I, I like it. I like that you can vary the colors and all that too. So yeah, I'll go ahead and put a yes on that. Next, the Comrades Kabuto. Wow, that actually is a really good looking cosmetic. Uh, you know what? And I think that one would work too. Uh, okay, so they're showing it off of like the heavy lifter and some stuff here, but we have a more recent cosmetic. I think it would actually go a lot better with that. Um, what was it? The the Captain's Kafta? The Capitan's Captain? Something like that, something like that. But you, you guys know the one, the samurai-looking one. Uh, yeah, I'm going to say yes to that one. I, you know what, I think it's about time the Heavy got some samurai cosmetics. We'll put that in, put that in. Uh, next, onto the Warrior's Vatnik. Uh, I don't know how much this one really goes with the Heavy theme. I mean, it's, it's cool-looking, it works. I, I don't know if it's really a Russian look or a Heavy look. I don't know. I, I'm going to put a... I'm going to put a Ask Me Again later. I'm not too quite sure about this one, to be honest with you. Your Majesty. Okay, okay, so this one is obviously a uh, Zelda reference. The the King of Zelda from way back, way back in like the cartoon series. Um, I mean, it's cool. Uh, I can't say it'd be the worst cosmetic we've got for Heavy. I mean, we've definitely got some meme cosmetics. Um, maybe a bit dated, but why not? You know, yeah, you got the crown, so why not? Yeah, we'll put it in, we'll put it in. The Bigger Man on Campus. This one's pretty cool. I mean, Scout kind of has something like this, so I, I guess it could work for Heavy too. Um, again, doesn't really seem to go much with the Heavy's actual theme, but you know what? We have a lot of cosmetics that don't these days, so why not? And yeah, it actually does look pretty cool and mix up a bunch of different cosmetics. So yeah, I'll go ahead and put my stamp of approval on that one. The Makeshift Millinery. All right, first off, I don't know how to pronounce it. Second off, what? W why? Just, just why? No. No, I, no, I don't want that. No. No. <laughs> okay, we've got next the Great Man's Great Coat. You know what? Actually, this looks really cool. And this goes with the Russian theme. Uh, this kind of looks like some sort of, like, captain look, like a military-type style. And yeah, it actually does pair up pretty well with other ones. They could have used a different hat for this one. That's probably... Maybe that's a hat that they worked on personally themselves. But yeah, no, I could definitely see this being put in. I'm going to put a yes on that one. The Shake Spiracles wig? The sh what in the blue hell is that? What is that? What is... No. 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 No, I'm sorry. Look, look. Nate, the Breadlord, look. I, like, I'm sure you made some great stuff. No. 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 The Big Boss. Okay. Okay. This is a good one. This is obviously... This is obviously a reference to uh, Gabe Newell. And people already try to make this type of reference with different heavy cosmetics now, but this one would be, like, the official one. And actually, this, this looks just really good. Uh, this kind of looks more like uh, a more recent Gabe, actually, because Gabe's got that uh, gray beard going on now. If, if you can do the hair, that would be the most recent. Yeah, see? You could do the most recent Gabe Newell, too. I like that. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm going to definitely put my stamp of approval on that one. I don't care how old this one is. That one's got to go in the game at some point. The Comedian. Wow, this this is a, a bit terrifying. Okay, so you've got kind of like a Joker heavy. It, this looks like the heavy that would be like drinking. Like, he's like he's like outside of a bar somewhere and he like 
ask if you if you want to see a magic trick and you're like oh oh god no and you like just step over him you're like oh go oh, jeez um but yeah no for the halloween look this is pretty terrifying i'll i'll give it that um yeah yeah sure halloween clown cosmetic for heavy not bad not bad the soviet slick bag um I mean, to be honest, this kind of just looks like one we already have. I, I can't remember the name of the beard cosmetic, um, but uh, it's the one that uh, Rider Cycle used to wear. It, it basically just looks like a basic beard. I guess it's supposed to be matched with the hair combo, but uh, I don't know. It's just too similar to stuff we already have, so I'm going to put no on that one. Uh, the Deli Chops. Wow, this looks sick. So this is like a chef? Um, I don't know. I mean, it's got a horror appeal to it, but also like in a... The Italian chef type vibe for a Russian character? Well, you know what? No, 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 no. Actually, you know what? No. This would be awesome for Heavy. You know why? Because Heavy throws food items. And, like, they even spin when you do it. So, like, he could be... He could literally be throwing his sandwich in the air. And it could be spinning and it's just like a chef. Oh, they should just... They should just go ahead and make, like, a pizza cosmetic then. Like, like a pizza reskin of, like, the sandwich or just, like, a pizza item in general. And they could, like, throw it up. And be like an actual chef. You know what? He's fat. He's got the look. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Let's put a yes on that one. World of Pain. Oh, wow. So this is a reference to the Big Lebowski. Wow. Okay. Wow. Cool. Yeah, that's very well done, too. That looks so good. Yeah, I, I like that. You know what? There was even a weapon concept I remember seeing where, like... They wanted to make a bowling ball for Heavy that he could throw as a melee. You could put that right in with this, you know? You could have a uh, big Lebowski with the bowling ball and everything. But even if you don't put that in, I mean, that looks so... That actually looks like the character. No, I really like that. That's attention to detail. That's that's very well done. Yeah, I'm going to put a yes on that one. The Man at Work. Okay, so like a construction worker? You know what? I wasn't sold on this, but now that I immediately see these cosmetic combos with it, yeah. Yeah, no, that does really look like a construction worker, both of these. That looks more like the YMCA-style <laughs> construction worker, but that that looks like a legit kind of construction worker, too. So, yeah, no, that's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. I'll uh, I'll put a yes on that. Moving on to the Hatvitch. Oh, see, oh, wow. Wow, no, this is my fault, mods. This is my fault. Yeah, see, this, is, this is, shows how dated this is, because now we already kind of have, like, a uh, Halloween sandwich cosmetic that went through for the heavy. So, for that reason, I mean, this did look pretty cool, um, but for that reason, I'm, I'm going to say no. But good job, uh, you underscore Will. Good job on that. The Chunky Chad. Um, okay, look. Look, I love memes too, but... <laughs> oh my god, they even make the poster. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hold on, we gotta see this, we gotta see this. Needs to paint every cosmetic lime or pink to call for attention. Has missing calls from his mother, never calls back. Drink sugary soda, can't outsmart bullet. <laughs> Meanwhile, you've got PhD in Russian literature, calls everyone baby. Giant arms to carry the team with. Oh, wow. Players pick medic just for him. Everyone wants to be his pocket. Relatable. Relatable. Um, listen, I love the meme. I, I can't. I can't. We've already got a mohawk, and it looks just like this. Even if the face looked like this for heavy, I just still I, I can't approve on that. I'm I'm gonna say no, but but thank you all of you creators. Okay, next, the warrior's wig. Okay, I, I you know what I actually do kind of like this one because I feel like when they put in some of those Mayan cosmetics, well, basically for the Jungle Inferno update, they took from the Mayan update that was being planned in the community, um, and they only took like. A couple really good ones. I like this one, but I don't like this one. The only reason I don't like this one is because of the hairline. I don't know why they did this to the hairline. I don't know if that's a reference to something, but I, that's the only thing I don't like about it. Oh, did they give heavy earrings too? Wow, okay, so they put a bunch into this. Um, But yeah, I just, I don't know, the hairline really bothers me on that one, so I'm going to say no. If it didn't, if it didn't have that going on, that would kind of remind me of my hair, to be honest. But uh, no, I'll, I'll pass on that one. Uh, the horny hood. The horny hood. Um, uh, if not just for the name alone, I'm going to put a hard pass on that one. That that looks like... Uh, oh, jeez, that kind of reminds me of like these monsters from like this old book. Um, oh, God, I can't remember the name. 
But uh, no, if not anything, just for the name alone, I'm, I'm going to pass on. The Wild Thing! That's what it was. The Wild Thing. Thank you for having that down there. But uh, yeah, no, still no. Uh, the Fried Egg. Moderators, I thought I told you to pick serious inquiries. This is a this is literally a fried egg on the heavy's head. What the fuck? Is there even are you telling me there's even a video to go with this? There's a video? Oh, thank you. Alright, so you're you're gonna show me Oh, it it has it has a physics engine to it, okay. And oh my oh my god. It's like a nipple on the heavy's head. It's like a moving nipple. Look at that. I I hate this. I <laughs> I hate, but I kind of like it. <laughs> I kind of hate that I kind of like this. It's <laughs> oh my! God. Just get that shit out of here. Get that out of here. Oh my god! All right. Um. I uh, oh my! I I literally just said mods. I I wanted you to pick serious stuff. We went from a boiled egg on the heaviest head to the Stay Puffed Man. Are you just turn heavy into a full-blown marshmallow? No, no, you know what? I just don't think that's for me. No, oh, and of course, of course it was. Of course it was created by the Stay Puffed Man. <laughs> wow. Okay, 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 now we're back to a serious one. Good, good, we're back on track. The Kozak Cover. Uh, yeah, no, this, this absolutely fits Heavy's look. This absolutely fits it. I wouldn't have put that colored hat on this but you know that on that yeah no it, it absolutely fits kind of the russian commander style look it's really well done too um it'd be cool if we had a beard like that actually to go with it yeah i'm gonna put a yes on that one uh the hat bow um mm, mm, i personally hate it but i know that we have hats kind of like this um Ah, uh, should I say yes for the sake of the community, or should I, yeah, I should die. This is my video. No, I'm putting a no. No, I'm putting a no. I'm not approving on that. Next, the heavy mascot. Oh, no, this isn't, oh, this is literally for every character. Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, that, that is nightmare fuel. No, I like this. I like this a lot, actually. Yeah, I... Maybe this should be like a Halloween only cosmetic because I'm really not trying to see that all year. That is that is terrifying. But um, yeah, no, I'm gonna put a yes on that. I'm absolutely that would be awesome. Hopefully they wouldn't it wouldn't change the head boxes like the hit boxes for your head um, to make it easier for snipers. But yeah, no, I like that. I like that a lot. The Kaiser, the Kaiser, the the Ka I don't know, man. The visor, okay, you know the one, that one, that one right there. Um, yeah, no, this looks really good. This looks really good. Uh, maybe, I wonder if they were designing this around the same time that they were working on that, like, what was it, RD underscore asteroid map. Uh, map. Um, maybe that's what this was for, but this looks really good. And it had, like, a full look with it, too. Oh, wow, and, like, a full comic-style drawing for it. That that looks awesome. Yeah, even even now, like, if they didn't put in all these cosmetics, or maybe if they, even if they did, I would I would really like this hat. That's awesome. And you can color it whatever you want. Yeah, no, that's cool. Actually, if you did that right, it would kind of look like a halo hat. Okay, yeah, no, definitely. The Spetsnaz special? Yeah, yeah, no, this one looks good. This looks clean. Um, this looks like, I think, a hat they already have for the uh, soldier. But this would look really good on heavy, too, and go with the theme. That's, yeah, these are good combos. I, I like it. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, the sandwich board. So this is basically like... Heavy has like a job at a nearby restaurant. He's advertising the moist and delicious sandwiches. Um, yeah, sure. I mean, why not? Um, it'd be kind of cool actually if that had like the physics engine to go with it too. So like this sign kind of moves and like slaps off the heavy as he moves. That'd be kind of cool. Um, double sided. Yeah, yeah. I'd take that. Uh, let me slap my yes on that real quick. The death breath. Man, I've seen this one in another variation. I don't know why they have not put this in the game yet. That is. It makes total sense, especially when they like were releasing all those cosmetics for the Arkham was it Asylum or um, Arkham Knight or something like that. When they released the Batman uh, mask, when they released the cape, why didn't they release a Bane mask for Heavy? That would have been so cool. He, he's bald. He's got like the, the the look for it, the build. He's got like this power builder type build. I still think this would be really cool. Um, even if they wanted to do work on it, you know, it does look a little. Maybe a little off with some of these, but I think it could be done. I think it would look really good and be really cool. I'm going to put my definite yes on that. Definitely. 
Um, the Secret Service suit. Yeah, this looks good. This looks good. Um, you know, I've I've kind of I've kind of wanted them to put in like some sort of suit cosmetic for heavy, especially because a lot of heavies like to do little mafia looks, <laughs> which could be this could be really cool for it. Um, maybe you could even slap those off. I mean, whatever. But the the suit idea for heavy would be good. Like we've got that one cosmetic that kind of does it, but not like fully commits to it like this would. So yeah, I'm gonna put a yes on that as well. The general winter that looks great. What is so is this? Oh, so this is like a combo. Okay. Okay, yeah. So like the Rusky Mask, the Rusky Mask Style 2, and the Cossacks cover. Yeah, I mean, I guess this is a two-for-one special. I'm going to say yes to all this. This looks incredible. This looks awesome. I think I think a lot of heavies, when this when this would drop in the store, would immediately buy this. Um, yeah, no, that's, that's awesome. Stamp of approval on that. And last, we have the Crook's Cap. This kind of looks like a... An old, like the old chap, like the, the bar pub fighter. I, I, I don't know, but, well, you know, maybe you could say that's like a Gaston style heavy. I, I don't know what I think. It, sure, maybe. It's, it's good. I can't say it's not good. Uh, I mean, maybe I'm just thinking of it with this type of look, though. I mean, yeah, you, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna put my approval on that one too. I'm gonna put my approval on that one too. I think. A bunch of people, even if I can't see it, I think a bunch of people would like that, and it works. It works with a bunch of different cosmetic combos, and you can color code it through pretty much anything. So, yeah, I'm going to put my stamp of approval on that one. And that is the end of our 30 different cosmetics um, or mist combinations. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, uh, leave a comment, leave a like below, and let me know if you want to see another one of these, but just way more updated, obviously. And, uh, yeah, until next time, later.